Hello everyone. I'm going to take another unboxing video. I I have just bought a new system organizer again, so I'm going to take an unboxing video of it. I just recently posted another unboxing video of a Prota Bible size ring binder, and now I bought another Bible size organizer. I'm a little surprised that I bought a new one as um, I haven't even started using the Prota Bible size yet, but I really wanted it so I couldn't help but buy it. <clears throat> So I bought a Roroma Classic Bible size, as you may have already guessed, uh, guessed by uh, looking at this box. And lately, I've been curious about system organizer and watching various vi YouTube videos. And among them, I thought Roroma Classic was so beautiful and nice that I just has to have it. Now let's open it up. It's nicely wrapped in paper. Uh, it has a warranty, etc. And I bought the Bible size blue. Um, I bought it because I thought the color was very beautiful and I love it. It has white powder, powdery stuff called bloom on it at first. I like this bloom very much, so I want to enjoy it as long as possible. I decided on a ring size of 50 millimeters. Uh, I didn't want it to uh, I didn't want it to thick and heavy, so I went with the smaller one. And since I bought it on Amazon, I didn't actually see the actual product, but I think this is a very lucky one. The surface has no streaks, uh, scratches, or tiger patterns, and the cover is really smooth and beautiful. The rings open and close smoothly. The inside stitches are also incredibly beautifully done. It also has a Da Vinci mark, a brand mark here. And the ring protectors are already sewn on, so it's safe. And there is a large pocket here and the inside is lined. Uh, there are two big pockets here too. It's very beautiful. And this pen holder can be pulled out to make it bigger or pushed in to make it smaller. It's an interesting design. I want to write in my organizer with a fountain pen. So I'm trying to put in uh, a Pelican M405 and I think it fits nicely but I don't think I dare to insert a Pelican fountain pen here and uncovered like this so I probably won't actually put it in here And this is a Pelican M800, uh, which is quite big, so I don't think it would be able to insert it here. Um, I think it might be possible if I force it in, but I don't think the Pelican M800 is the kind of pen you would insert casually in a pen holder like this, so I'll put it in the pen case again. <laughs> Yes, I always use a planner to 
organize my schedule and I use this friction ball four color pen slim uh, to write down my schedule. So I think I I actually use this pen mainly for writing. Uh, this pen fits perfectly fine. So I will actually use it like like this. And this is a uh, a supporter band. Uh, no, this is a stopper band. And I saw many videos that said this band is quite tight and difficult to insert at first. And it's, it is indeed tight, but not too stiff. And I was able to insert it quite smoothly. The back side has a little streaking. Uh, can you see it? Uh, this is a line. Uh, there is a line the low, in the lower center, but the front side is really smooth and beautiful. And this Roroma, Cla Roroma Classic is very generous. They give you a free set of refills. And Prota didn't come with any refills, so I had to buy all the refills myself. But this Roroma Classic comes with a set of refills so that um, you can start using it right away. Also, the price of Roroma Classic was cheaper. I bought it on Amazon for about 14,000 uh, 14, yen, and the Prota Bible size is probably 19,000 yen. So I think the Roroma Classic is reasonable. The Roroma Classic comes with filter uh, lifters. Uh, cover page and a bookmark that says today on it so I can start using it right away without buying anything in particular and as I said when I bought Prota I like this type of bookmark uh, better than the type that covers the entire page so I'm glad it comes with the narrower bookmark it was covered with protective film at first, but it was difficult to peel off and I had a, a bit of trouble. But I think it looks easy to use. And there are several types of paper refills in the package. The first one is a monthly refill. I think the paper used for Da Vinci refills is Tomoe River, but this paper doesn't feel like Tomoe River by any means. And I was wondering that. The surface is rough and the thickness is much thicker than Tomoe River. So I wondered what kind of paper this is. And later, I found out that the refills that comes as a free gift are not Tomoe River, it's just regular paper. I think Da Vinci has another se series using a paper called ta Takegami, which means bamboo paper, but it's not that either, and it's not Tomoe River, it's just normal paper. Uh, well. Uh, it's a free refill, so I don't think uh, they provide high quality paper. I guess it's just a sample of their layout. And there's also weekly left type refill. They are all undated, so you can start using them any at any time. Also, there is a note refill with horizontal ruled lines. The lines are green. I like it because uh, it gives a calm feeling. And this is the checklist. I really like this layout. It looks cute and easy to use. 
and the green and cream paper colors、uh, match each other. So I think I'd like to use it. And finally, there is an address book refill in there. The quality of the paper was a little different and it's smoother. Well,、uh, I probably don't use the address book refill,、uh, but the, the surface is a bit smoother than other refills. And you probably can't tell the difference on the screen, but the checklist paper is rough and the address book paper is smooth. And they give quite a few sheets of pages too. And then Uh, there is a card case. I guess it holds about three cards. Three cards.、Uh, this is also included. I don't really want to use my organizer like a wallet, so I won't use it. But the pockets are cut in a V shape, so you can put there,、uh, put three cards、uh, vertically. Okay, the last one is a pocket refill, which looks like a ziplock.、Uh, this might be good if you want to use stickers or other paper things with your organizer.、Uh, it has,、um, and it has no、uh, plastic clasp or anything like that, and、uh, you just press, press it to close. The opening by hand. And at the end, there's an information sheet for refills, and it says here that the Da Vinci refills are Tom a River. So I wondered if the ones that came with this binder are also Tom a River or not. After I got this Roroma Classic, I also received the Da Vinci refills, which、uh, I had ordered separately, and they are Tomoe River. So,、uh, compared to them, the free refills had a totally different feel and thickness, so I could clearly see that they are not Tomoe River refills. So, two lifters are included one on the front and one on the back as well, and they are very nice.、Uh, the lifters are transparent. The floaters lifters are black, so the transparent one is quite、uh, unique to me. Now, let's set them up. I put the cover page too, just because、uh, it looks cool. I, I don't think I actually use the monthly refills at all, but now、uh, let's see if I can fit them all in. And I also put the bookmark. And it looks like there's enough room for all the refills.
Then I close the belt and it's quite heavy because it can hold many pages. The 15 mm diameter is probably small as a, a system organizer, but it's much denser than Prota. On the back side, you can see some streaks in these three places. I think uh, these are probably the marks of blood vessels. Uh, they are not uh, scratches, but marks that are originally on the leather. Uh, but I don't mind it because it's unique character of the leather and I think it makes me feel more attached to it. And now um, I'm trying to flip through the binder with everything in it. Uh, but even uh, with uh, all refills, it's comfortable to flip through the pages and it still has plenty of room. And I bought this Varoma Classic Bible size without any particular purpose, so I haven't decided what I, I will use it for, and I haven't decided how I use it combined with the Prota Bible size yet. Um, And I have a Da Vinci Tomoe River refill in my Prota M5, so I'm just now touching it to see how it feels. I was thinking that uh, this refill is really Tomoe River at this time. And I originally bought the Prota Bible size ring binder for scheduling. Um, I work from home, so I can. Uh, I can leave my scheduling uh, planner at home all the time, so I thought I wouldn't have to carry it around so much. So this year, uh, I decided to use Hobonichi Cousin, but uh, sometimes I get work emails while I'm out and I have to check my schedule. But I don't take my Hobonichi cousin with me when I go out, so I can't check my schedule. So I wanted to make it more co convenient size to take with me. And then I, I thought the Prota's Bible size is a good choice. But I bought this Roma Classic Bible size, and I know some people carry around uh, Bible size binders, but for me, uh, it's a little too heavy and thick to carry with me. So I think I will use it at home. And I would like to keep everything in one book. So I will usually put my schedule refills with other refills in this organizer and use it at home. And when I go out, uh, I will move only the schedule refills to the plotter and carry it with me. That's my uh, plan so far. And I also have a Prota M5 bridle, which I just bought recently, and it still has bloom. And they are similar because both of them are blue bloom leather. Um, the shades are a little different, but the bloom of these new leathers is very beautiful. So I want to enjoy it as long as possible. Thank you very much for watching and see you soon.